What's up, YouTube? Random Tuesday thoughts. We are back in the car, headed him. Big week coming up. Already kind of was a big week. Yesterday's video was kind of a bigger hit than I thought it was going to be. Um, I was basically just talking about yo-yo contests and what I think works well, what I think doesn't work well, and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, Michael, who is a good friend of mine and an excellent yo-yo judge and just a great person in the community, uh, he's also a very uh, sort of outspoken um, wanter of contests to be better, we'll put it that way, because that's, that's how I see myself. And he posted it on the yo-yo BST, and that was mixed reactions. Some of it was good. Some of it was more like, you don't know what you're talking about. I understand that. I get it. Um, one thing that was pointed out to me in that little interaction on the BST was, why don't you just ask the, the, the organizers of the contest? And I was like, huh, why not? Let's see. What, what the hell? What could happen? So I emailed them, got an email back real fast, actually. So uh, it's good to know that uh, the National Yo-Yo Contest is well, uh, at least tracked email wise. And, uh, basically it seems like they just kind of need some tax advice, tax rules, tax law on that, uh, which makes sense. Um, if you're going to give out money, clearly it's taxable. Uh, and that's sort of, I guess, not to say what's holding them back necessarily, but what's their sort of reservations about paying cash prizes to winners. Um, so I'm going to do a little bit of tax research and uh, write them up a little report slash proposal type of thing. And uh, we'll see. We'll see how this goes. So I'm actually kind of excited about what's come out of that video. Although I had to write a separate email, so it wasn't that necessarily, but cool things could be coming. Uh, and I'll keep you guys updated with what I find. Taxes are boring, but I, I do have a law degree. I do kind of work in like retirement and I do a lot of tax stuff. So yeah, I'll, uh, I, I may be hitting up some, some friends who may have some, uh, who have some accounting experience as well. And just kind of trying to, to get that all situated. Uh, because I think that would be an amazing thing, at least on the U S national level to be able to do it in some, some form, some capacity. I think that would be great. Uh, as far as, in, you know, the world yo-yo contest that takes place in different countries. So that would be different every year, but, uh, you know, baby steps, baby steps. Let's get the, let's get this nationals thing figured out first and we will go from there. So I'm going to work on that and, uh, I'll keep you guys updated with what I figure out. Moving on, big week. I know that Zipline Strings is dropping its first ever yo-yo on Friday. The Honey Badger drops Friday. So I've had mine for over a week now, and I'm going to do a review of it this week. You'll probably see the review either Thursday or Friday. I want to get it up like but right before. I did the unboxing, so you saw what it looked like. It's it's phenomenal. In fact, I played it. I'm like, oh, I, I, I might like this better than my yo-yo, than the one I designed. It's really good. Holy cow, Is it's a beast. It's like a kind of a smaller yo-yo, but like the finish is just mm, so good. It, it's got some like some unspoken yo-yo flavors to it. Uh, very, very Apollo feeling, but a little smaller, but bigger than, uh, it's just good. It's just all real good. And I'm going to, uh, I'll be reviewing it this week and getting that up for you guys so that you can see and, and know before you go out and buy it. But I think it's only like 55 bucks. It's cheap. It's like super budget, but it is like super premium feeling. I mean, it is super smooth, great grind. I mean, just a, just a phenomenal yo-yo. Um, you know, I might be biased cause I really like zipline. I really like, but I'm not cause I, I would have told him it was a bad yo-yo if it wasn't, but it's so good. It's such a good yo-yo. I'm very excited to actually review it. Uh, I've been playing it an awful lot. I've actually been playing a good bit of yo-yo lately. It's finally, the weather's starting to break a little bit. We had a little cold snap, a couple of cold days, but we're back in the 50s or 60s right now. So all is well again. And uh, been playing some outside yo-yo. My son's had some soccer practice, so I'm playing yo-yo. It's his soccer practices. And it's just been, it's been fun. Man, yo-yo is good in the springtime. I'm not always the biggest fan in the summertime because 
I don't know, it just gets sweaty and it's like muggy and humid, but we've got some new strings we've been working on. So I'm hoping when it gets terrible that they sort of take on the properties of what nylon string does well in the summertime and that is not feel disgusting. So maybe that will help. We'll see. We'll see what happens as time moves on. But that's that's where we are with that. So Honey Badger playing yo-yo outside because finally the weather is starting to break. Holy cow. Uh, in addition to that, contest season is here. It is going strong and yo-yo release season is here and going strong. I've been firing out yo-yo releases. I know everybody else has been firing out yo-yo yo -yo, uh, videos and stuff. Uh, the metal head is in production. Uh, I haven't paid for it yet, but we also haven't been charged for it yet. So the metal head is in production. It's going to be all splash colorways. Super excited about it. Jeremy and I are super stoked about it. And uh, it's going to be good. It's Man, it's going to be good. I'm so excited for the metal head to come out. I think May is the target date. I think it's coming in May, but we may get it out this month. I'm not 100% certain. He's got the release schedule, not me. So he's the one that sort of has a better idea, a better like date in mind. I just know it's coming out in the next month or so, which is phenomenal. So excited for it. Can't wait. Gonna be the best. Uh, and I mean, that's pretty much it, man. It's been, it's been a week. I'll tell you what, you guys listened to me talk like for 18 minutes yesterday. So I'm going to probably cut this one a little short, a little short for me. And, uh, let Jin's guys go, but uh, yeah, lots of good things happening, uh, and I am very excited about the fun discussions we're able to have, and about all of the fun things coming up, including fun new yo-yos coming out, just because there's so much good stuff, I still need to get on that one drop stuff on, on the Par Avion, I need to get that, I love one drop, they're so good, I, I, need, to, I need the Par Avion, I need to get one, I should probably do that when I get home, huh? Yeah, I think I will. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. Cheers to you. I'll see you next time.